morning, good morning, good morning, everyone. Lisa here. This is Lisa 6 and 3, and here is God's strength for you this day. Our scripture reading is coming from Genesis 24. We're going to talk about Sister Rebecca today, Isaac's wife. Um, let's go to um, verses, let's see, where I want to start. Let's go 16. So this is Genesis 24, verses 16. Now the young woman was very beautiful to behold. That means she was pretty. A virgin, no man had known her. And she went down to the well, filled her pitcher, and came up. And the servant ran to meet her and said, Please, let me drink a little water from your pitcher. So she said, drink, my lord. Then she quickly let her pitcher down to her hand and gave him a drink. And when she had finished giving him a drink, she said, I will draw water for your camels also until they have finished drinking. Now, if you don't know the story between Isaac and Rebecca, uh, Isaac, um, <laughs> Daddy sent his man on a, his men on a mission. Well, just one, um, Eleazar, on a mission to find him a wife. And the the way that they knew the woman, the wife uh, for Isaac, um, had come forth is if she would draw some water, not just for him, but for the camels. And Rebecca did that. And because of that, she received a blessing by becoming Isaac's wife. Eleazar went as Isaac, um, Rebecca's father, for her hand to take back to Isaac to be married, and that did happen. Now, Rebecca is known as the woman who deceived her husband because well, she loved Jacob and he loved Esau. But what I want to focus on this morning is her being at the right place at the right time. Because there were, I'm sure, a lot of virgin girls who were pretty, but they were not at the right place at the right time with the right offering. Because Rebecca gave the right offering, which was water to the camels. And that was the sign that she would be a woman who knew how to go and take care of not just herself and not just the man, but everything that came and comes with the man. She was a woman that took care of the household. There are a lot of us. This is our thought today. Don't just be the woman who takes care of yourself person be the woman who takes care of the man and everything that comes along with the man even when you don't know what's coming with the man because she didn't know all that was gonna happen to her when she said i do to i that's some good stuff y'all don't know what's gonna come when you say i do that might be the topic you just don't know what's gonna come when you say I do. Just be ready to serve. That was some good word. This has been Lisa with Lisa 6 and 3. This has been a wonderful week, y'all. A wonderful week. Thank you for your support. Now, share the word with someone. Let them know that there is a blessing when you're in the right place at the right time. Now, you go make it a wonderful day. And I will see you when... Be blessed.